Welcome back, everyone. We're already on the road. I decided to save us some time uh, by getting a head start since it was just, you know, boring driving. The real stuff, the real experience starts now when we're driving down the road where there could possibly be zombies, since we know that the dirt or gravel road, wherever the hell it is, probably gravel. Um, since we know that road, is relatively secure, while this road is clearly not. There's a lot more zombies here than I remember. Maybe I should pull over and deal with that real quick. It is night, though. I already turned the car off. Shit. All right, come here, nerds. See if I can get this guy before anyone else shows up. Ah, yeah, you like that, don't you? No, kill him, thank you. Right, let's jump it again. Hey, no. No biting. Lunacid night is not necessarily the best thing to do. Sure, I could use a gun to like do this quicker, but why waste ammunition when there could be, you know, potentially a horde at the, you know, location that we're going to? And instead, I could just use my baseball bat here to get us uh, where we want to go. Also, it's good to waste a little bit of time here um, before the sun comes up. I like to actually be able to see what I'm doing most of the time. Here. All right, we'll pull into the gas station here in a moment. I think I'm close enough to get that pumping. We'll just have to turn on the generator. Don't interrupt my fuel into my car, buddy. Okay, we'll fuel up. Okay. Turn off the generator. You're a different person than what I saw before, I think. Where was the bald old man who was here, huh? Where did he go? The bald old man, where'd you go? Maybe it was just her and I just mistook her hair for a bald old man. I don't know. Whatever, we are full gas now. Let's rock. Maybe we can also check out the uh, fire station and actually get some good protective armor or clothing anyway. I might do that first.
I want to check something. I saw this work truck. Do they have a sledgehammer? No, but they do have leather gloves. I'm gonna take. <laughs> Wear those while I'm uh, walking. Take a moment to put those on. There we go. All right, I'm gonna put these gloves into my bag. So is that like a, a generator? I think it might be. How many kills do we have? 300? We need to get to that magic 600 or 500, where the hell it is. Come on, losers. Get away from my car so I can get in, please. Uh, get in. Oh, fuck you. Why's the game gotta be like that, huh? Come on. Get away from the car. All right, now I think I can move back. But yet, there they are, right in front of my freaking car still. Okay, you know what? If I wasn't so panicked, I'd be doing a lot better at this. Actually, that was perfect. That was one for one for headshots. Like, just everyone dying. I mean, if I can, I'll just kind of go back to my car, but depends upon how many there are still around it. Oh, so now y'all want to come up here, huh? to my advantage here. Shoot through it. Alright, let's jump it again. They really, really want my car, huh? Well, screw it. I have ammo to spare. Might as well kill some while we're here. I wish I had more magazines, though.
next one. We'll just keep doing this for a little bit. I still have two more guns and ammunition to go through, so... I don't know how I missed, like, most of those shots there, but that's a little annoying. Alright, jump the fence. Thank you. We're gonna walk around the outside here. So hopefully they lose line of sight of me. Jump this. I'm getting exhausted though. They should be somewhere in there. If I can get to my goddamn car, I can just leave. We left it running, so. Perfect. Good God. Stop for one thing and it turns into a huge battle, don't it? Let's drive near the fire station. We'll see if it is overrun or if there's only a couple zombies. If there's just that many there, maybe we take them out. Yeah, let's do it. You know what? Let's... back up into the area. Alright, y'all, come on. Alright, got him. Nice. Firefighter pants. Perfect. Put those on right now. How are my boots looking? These are better condition, wear them. I will keep the other boots that I had on, though. Yep. Oh, hello there. You want some, too? Bro, we don't even get that startled when we, you know, see a not zombie. Why are you dropping your, your things when you just schizo out, my guy? What's your problem? Did I bring any food with me? I brought chips, that's right. Alright, go ahead and take that pill. Let's smoke before we go in there too, because I think we are at the point where, yeah, we're at negative 30 melee damage. Alright, let's clear it. First of all, garbage can. Thank you. Piece of tape. Ooh, uh, radio. I'll disassemble that in a moment. Probably when we're outside. Or back at the base. Would be better because then it wouldn't break down into parts. Cause me to have to do a bunch of different things with it. Keep track of all that nonsense, you know. Got an empty mug. Garbage, 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 garbage. Let's go ahead and uh, just refill our water bottle and stuff while we're here. No point not doing so. secure another garbage bag oh hey did 
did I hit him so hard his body like just disappeared? Anyway, we found a firefighter jacket. Let's go ahead and get that on. I can put the uh the backpack full, huh? Okay. I want these firefighter pants too. And more military boots as well. What am I carrying that's making me so uh heavy? Okay. Got a helmet. You know, I'm gonna go out to the car real quick. So I can put some stuff away. In the trunk. Also maybe rest, because apparently we are, uh... Carrying way too much. surroundings real quick get the crowbar in there the garbage bags we can throw in there too radio which apparently two pounds I'm gonna throw the chips in there I'm gonna grab one that we can use just in case of emergencies piece of tape can go in there too all right Right now, let's go ahead and we'll just uh, sleep, I guess. Ugh. Before going back in there, let's smoke. I don't even know what the hell happened. I pressed a button and I got out and was starting to do something else. Maybe I hit a shortcut to vehicle mechanics and I was heading to the hood. All right, my exercise fatigue. Lovely. But I figure I can grab uh, the extra firefighter gear, and I'll have that in case this stuff breaks or deteriorates. Or if we die and we need to, you know, reset before we can actually get our gear. Oh, we're schizo again. Oh, can't carry more boots there. Oh, the pistol. It's a little bit damaged. I don't think I'll take it. A lot of you zombies in here, huh? The shame the firefighter gear is like heavy, like really heavy. Throw this stuff in the trunk as well. Once again. <gasps> My lighter was empty. Did you see that? Crap. I thought it would survive a little longer. Oh, that's fine. Oops. 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 There we go. Alright, let's keep moving. Oh, look, another firefighter. Jesus. This is the most I've seen in, like, a long time. God. I'm carrying all this stuff. I'm just so overweight. Alright, let's check this door first. In the supply room. Let's close the door. We do need more nails. We are running low on those. Sort of. Before I open up that, let's check just this area here. Okay, that's pretty open. This area is empty. How about this? Hold on. I got an idea. 
rather than having to go all the way through this place again, let's go out here. We'll just pull the car in, and then it'll be relatively safe from bad things, I say, as we run out of space for our stuff. God, this stuff did not weigh like four pounds each. I can come over here, close the door, and we can take a look at what else we have here. Tire repair kit. Cool. I don't really need anything else there. Tire repair tools. I'll take the nails and the rope. Then we have these lockers, which might have more firefighter gear in them. Now let's take this guy out first. Hey, fitness leveled up. Nice. the helmet there, grab the pants there, grab the key there. All right, I guess I will take these military boots as well. Why not? Keys to these. Ooh, we got another axe, perfect. gonna be heavy but let's go we just got to get into the car and we just throw all our stuff back in here God, we just have so much firefighter gear now Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to siphon a little bit of gas out of here. We're going to use it to uh, refill our lighter. And then I'll go ahead and add gasoline back into it. Just the stuff that we took, basically. Will this fit in here? It will. Perfect. Right, let's enjoy a smoke as we uh, search the rest of the area. Screwdriver, crowbar, another axe, a couple axes, actually. Three? Oh my god. It's beautiful. Two more axes. Next seat. Yep. Okay, that's good. Now just this middle door, and then we can go search upstairs. Uh, alcohol wipes, suture needles, bandage, uh, 
nice. More schizomads. In fact, speaking of, let's go ahead and take another one. One alcohol wipe back, though. Thank you. A zombie over there. I'll grab those. Always good to have, right? All right. Upstairs. Let's go. I guess we can also sleep up here. Since we, uh, we're getting tired. Bathrooms. Bedroom. This is the locker room, yeah. Oh my god, please don't tell me there's more gear in here, please. I will take, like, a, a mask of some sort. So much stuff. Let's head back downstairs one more time, unload this stuff, and we'll come up here, finish the search. Hopefully, we won't find any more uh, gear. I can't get inside. I have to actually get over here. Oh, hey, there's chips in here. Nice. Well, I can't fit these firefighter pants anywhere. Garbage bag will fit there, though. How about the metal pipes and the propane torch? Will those fit anywhere else? As a start, how about this? Better than nothing. God dang. Okay. Hop out. Put that on the ground. We'll smoke while we head up. Alright, it's still fairly early. I don't really want to sleep and then just be like, oh yeah, by the way, we uh, now I have to go search at night. So let's not do that. Search the rest of this layer here before we start looting this stuff. And that's just the pull down. Nice. All right, cool. Let's disassemble what we can and take what we can. Ooh, they got sugar and cereal here, huh? Don't really care about the sugar. I was hoping they had actual books there. But apparently not. Red and tape. Canned foods.
baking soda. I think I need that for uh, something like biofuel or something, if I remember correctly. Hey. Well, that's everything looted then. Go take a sleep. And then we'll head back downstairs. And do uh, what we can. How am I more tired now than I was before? How about we do some squats? And now we sleep again. That's what I thought. Sort of that tired nonsense. Alright, 5 o'clock in the morning, we should very easily be getting some, uh, daylight soon, perfect for us. Also, it took us like 30 minutes to get here, search everything, and then come on out, so... Alright, before we open the door to head out... Let me just put what I can away. It'll be more helpful than not doing that. That stuff will fit. Red light bulb will fit there. Never know when you're going to be able to loot more stuff, so... I gotta make a count. All right. Crap. Well, let's go ahead and finish off this cereal box then. Hmm. Good stuff. And it looks like we are gaining plenty of weight here. All right, let's start with turning the car on. Get it near the door. Let's do it to it. All right, down to the prison we go. Looking for, uh trailer or anything like that. We still have not figured out where the armory in the prison is either, so... Depending on how many uh, zombies we've managed to clear, it might be worth taking a look at, seeing if we can find out where the armory is. Are in the middle of the way here. Our goal right now is just reconnaissance. If we don't see anything we want here, we can just leave. All there is to it. Well, I don't see anything I want here. How about we make a uh, circle of the prison here? I don't know if there's any other parking lots. Maybe like behind or anything like that. Oh, screw on. Surely they have to have like a loading dock or something somewhere, right? Where they would like load in supplies. Alright, yeah, there's doesn't, doesn't appear to be anything here that would be of use for us. Real quick, let's open up the map. Pause the game so we don't, you know, have stuff happen in here. Hmm. <sighs> So the question is, what do we do now? We have about 30 minutes of the game time left. It'll probably take us at least five to return home. 
We could try to go south further, but I don't know what else would be south. Like where else would there be a, a place that would have a trailer? You know? Hmm. Okay. I think we've basically thoroughly searched this town for anything that would possibly have a trailer. Um, Maldru is a lot harder to actually search since it has uh, so many zombies in, in this area. But I think along this way, we've confirmed that there's no major trailers or anything. But then there's no more parking lots really around this area. So our only other option would be to go to another city. We could go to, I think we started here, right? And I didn't see anything. But then again, we didn't have much time to really do much searching. Also, is there another way out of this town, like up north? Because if we go through Doe Valley, we could then go up to, is this Riverside or is that the other? Is this Riverside? I don't remember. Hmm. And at that point, if we did go that far away from home, um, it would be almost worth it to just take the semi-truck instead. Yeah. We'll go ahead and just leave. Out of the way, please. This car is getting a little worse for wear as well. is uh, not ideal at the moment. Maybe our next goal is to replace this car. You know? Replace with something better looking. Not necessarily looking, but... Better, uh... Alright, this is the street that I dumped all the zombies on. I was gonna go turn down there and just, like, go through them, but yeah, I didn't know. Never mind. Go around this way. I want whatever this trailer is. Nothing else, I just want to see like what it is exactly. Let's get out. And we can uh clear some zombies. Like, excuse me, I want four. Thank you. Alright, reload. Nice and slowly, nice and easily.
How far deep into the town are we again? Grocery stores right here, and then further up north is the uh, gas station. Yeah. Well, screw it. We need pills to get desensitized, so let's work on that. Nothing else. Both can make it. Weird. Oh, here they come. We're getting pretty far away from the car there. I think that's fine. Shame that the uh, shotgun is out of ammo because it's nice. You can get like three zombies with one shot potentially. Oh, here comes some more. So it might not be bad to get rid of all this ammunition, since we uh, do have another pistol as well. Let's go around this house rather than going through that little uh, choke point. All right, run low on ammo. I suppose we're up to in terms of kills. 500? Yeah, just there. Alright, we're out. Let's, uh... Can I put these in my bag? Yeah, I can. Can I remove this from my holster? I'm pretty sure I just dropped that on the ground. I just have it in my hand still. Duh. Where is the FAL? Yeah. 
There we go. I didn't think it was going to do armor penetration. That works for me. Well, not armor penetration, but penetrating through them. It does take a hot minute to reload it, though. That was close. Another second and we would have been zombie food right there. sure where I uh, left the car at again. I think it's just to the right of the church, yeah? Yeah, there she is. Why don't I target the guy in front of me, huh? We're gonna do this. Let's actually get them all into a horde. That way I can more easily shoot multiple at the same time. Otherwise, it's just I'm wasting ammo at that point. So if I miss one zombie, it might hit the one next to it, right? The way it goes. You know, me being so panicked, my aim's just all over the place, so. Nice about getting me like a tighter horde. Here we go. Get them nice and tight. Let's reload. No, I had like two shots left, but that's not going to do anything. Go. That was like 15 zombies there. <laughs> Do I still have food on me? I do. Let's eat some chips. Imagine, like, you're just a survivor, and you're just walking past 
zombies while you know, stuffing your face with a bag of chips, right? Why not the one in front of me? Hmm? Let's get you guys closer together. Come on. Come on, nice and tight. Let's go. Alright, one, two, three, four, turn and. Alright, let's reload. I think this is the gas station. Yeah. No, this is the grocery store. Alright. Gas station's full. It's still a little bit further north. Come on, gather up, folks. That one goes a little bit faster than the others right there. Don't like that. This gun does pretty well. Not as good as the shotgun would, but it does pretty good. I really don't want them at the gas station, so we're gonna like lure them this way, in and around, and then do kind of a loop here. Come on. Come on, all y'all. Double back on yourselves. Come on. Pull the trees. Whew, okay. Keep moving. I don't want to get exhausted, so let's stop running now. Alright. I could have been reloading. I guess I'll reload now. When we're done reloading, we'll turn and fire at them. Did you get on my face, dude? God dang. like when hordes collide. <laughs> Let's go. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Guy passing through. Go ahead and just reload. I know I still have 10 bullets in the clip. Magazine, not clip. But, uh... Well, we had some downtime reload there. All right, let's go back down this street. I think this looks like a nice street. Here. Let's go ahead and collect them up a little bit closer. What's that guy having? It's crowbar. I thought it looked like an LMG or something. I'll look now. Once we get to the edge of this building, I'm going to turn around, blast them all in the face, and we're going to try to lose them, all right? Let's 
Let's go. We're just gonna run the other side of the building. Once we're there, we'll start reloading. Start reload. And then we'll just kind of cut across the street and head back to our car. Excellent. All right, let's go. And we're going to jump behind this fence, because if we do that, we'll be cut off from their side of things. In fact, why don't we, uh, we have been running around a lot. Why don't we go take a rest in this house? I'm not going to worry about looting anything. I'm just going to try to get up there for now. Bathroom. Here's the bedroom. Close that door for me. God bless. A fanny pack, finally. All right. Go ahead and sleep now. So I think we've lost the zombies uh, a decent amount here. Um, let's go ahead and eat what we can real quick, just so we are ready and raring to go. Have a smoke. So how many kills do you think we're at now? 700? 800? Ooh, almost 800. All right. And then, why don't I go ahead and take the items that I want to keep on my person. Put them in my fanny pack. Perfect. And then, uh, to throw that there. I want to keep five bandages with me. The rest I'll put back in the stock. Oh, that's so nice. Oh my god, okay. Alright, let's search the rest of this house a little bit. We're not going to do a too thorough of a job, but I will take these 9mm rounds, of course. Um, I just don't care about that gun, let's be honest. Alright. Cologne, cigarettes. Sometimes there's little gun cases in those. Let's see if I can find a bookcase. Like, what's this magazine here? Electronics magazine. I already know it. Well, let's go ahead and disassemble their TV at least. Go. Let's go ahead and refill our water. Perfect. And finally, this little tiny hole here. Ooh. Another 1911 magazine. Nice. I'll go ahead and take that. I also have a carbine, which I think we already have one of, but I'll take it just in case as well. Never hurts nothing to be prepared. Have extra stuff, you know. I forgot I saw this here. Let me take a look real quick. Ooh, it's in bad condition. Can I get into it, at least? I can, but the lock's broken. I'd have to smash the window. What if I smash the window on this side, though? Door one. Let's go ahead and unlock all the doors. All right, the lock's broken. I can't. Um. All right. First try, baby. Get 
moves. Zombies right here, though. Right, I can't get out of the side. Oh my god, that's awful. It's just one guy coming over here. Hey. It is a generator. Okay. Here's the thing, though. If I try to take the Humvee, I could potentially lose it, and also have a bunch of stuff in the way, in the in the red car here. So we're just gonna go ahead and uh, take the generator, which come in handy because we can basically just use it wherever we want. So if we need to go to another gas station, uh, we can just use it to power gas stations, basically. In fact, hold on a moment. It was down here, right? So let's go ahead and put um, that there to mark that we have both a semi and a Humvee right there. Because if nothing else, we can use that uh, semi for, for parts, for the other semi. Or choose which one's the better one and go from there. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, how are we looking here? Good. Did I get another thing here, or am I just sticking stuff? I was thinking maybe I got the... Organized, thick skin, strong, weak stomach. You know, all we've already had. Hmm. We're not desensitized yet. At least it's not telling us we are. I think this is the most zombie kills we've uh, gotten. Or did we get a thousand one time? I forget. Anyway, let's, uh, let's smoke. So, well, we, uh, we didn't find a trailer, but we did find a generator. We got a bunch more zombie kills, leveled up our aiming and reloading a bit. Actually, I don't think we leveled them up at all, to be completely honest. I think we just uh, did the bare necessities. The, uh, the zombies are starting to get really close to our territory now. I don't like that. Hmm. Well, folks, um, I think we'll just go ahead and park this generator at home. I'll unload the car, and then we'll gear up for, uh, I guess, heading north back to Doe Valley. There's still a bunch of, like, MREs and um, water left in that airdrop up there, too, which we can take. Uh, so that would be nice to, to do. We can also take a further look at the town, because I think we were just trying to get out for the most part. There's also that uh, medical building that's there. We can raid that for some loot. See how that goes, but uh, I think we'll take the semi, maybe, if we're uh, gonna go anywhere with that. Because uh, the semi, well, it'll have a. Uh, if we find a trailer, we'll be able to just hook the semi up to it directly, so that'll be great. Although, I don't know what we'll have to see. If we get lower than half gas, we'll have to turn around with it, so. 
don't know. I'll, I'll decide and we'll go from there. So until next time, everyone, bye-bye.